Today is December 2nd. We are starting off our day. My sister woke up and told me to put my face on, which is like rude because now everyone's starting to do the same thing. What? Requesting for makeup. <laughs> the gays do it, now well, they think they can do it. If you can do it for your friends, you can do it for me. I, if they request, I feel like I should request too or else I'm going to miss out. I get a picture of her in her fur coat and no face these days. Even on the cruise, you get no cute picture with you. So, I put my face on. It took a moment because there's no mirrors, like big mirrors to see. I had to like do it through a small mirror. And my face is like really starting to like drag because I'm like tired. And the lashes were like forever to put on. But we're ready. Are we ready? Always ready. Do you need help with your hair? I don't know my hair. It looks like a porcupine. Thanks to you. Let's go fix it. Okay, we are here at Gaylord Opryland Hotel. Resort. Just to check out their activities, festivities. Um, Evelyn looks like she's sleeping. Yeah. Oh no. Wake her up. We tried, but it was me. <laughs> here we are. <laughs> Don't get stuck in here. <laughs> So this was also recommended by the same person on Instagram. What's her name? Wow, you guys are so fast. <laughs> Let's go check out this amazing hotel. It looks kind of like a Vegas hotel. I just told you in the car you don't listen to me. Did you? I said it reminds me of Vegas where it's a big resort and they have stuff to do in the middle. Well, speak up louder. I like this guy's jacket. <laughs> no. Maybe for like Don V or something. <laughs> that, this is new. This? That sound wave. It's open yesterday. So basically like a pool. Right? Oh my god, like Great Wolf then. Great Wolf, I feel like for adults. It doesn't have a lot of Okay, okay. So let's see where we want to go. I think my sister wants to eat first, so let's look for a place for her to eat because she can get loud. Cranky! Are you hungry, baby girl? Hungry? No? Sleepy? Okay, just close your eyes. Lynn wants sushi. We're gonna go eat at wasabis. Look at that. It's an eel. Go touch it. Another fish are here too. See a fish? It's a water snake. Mm. Crazy, huh? You see any more fishes? Yeah. Okay, let's go eat. Let's go get something to eat, okay? Come back and look. Yeah, right here. Ew. Yeah. Alright, let's go check this out. We're at Cascade and Wasabi's. Brisket bun me for $18. Halacha. First up, we have an avocado toast with some fries, some poke right here. This is a crab bisque. And miso soup. Switch. Miso soup is mine. Crab is his. Look at that. Me and you, the two oxens, have the soup. And these two have the, like, meals. The bigger, hearty meals. They're both prepping for babies. They're both prepping for babies, exactly. This one and this one. And both of us don't want it. Can we get a hallelujah? Can we pray on it? <laughs> and we have some edamame. Let me know what I have. With wasabi! What is that? Pickles! Her favorite, pickles! Lynn got herself some sushi. This is life for her. Then we got spaghetti for Olivia and some fruits. We've got a tuna melt. And Mr. Kiwo got the banh mi. Bun mi bread. This is definitely not your normal bun mi. Not your normal bun mi. This yeah. is a bun mi brisket. I was expecting a normal bun mi, but this All is right. better. Taste it and see how it tastes like. I'd appreciate like fresh uh, chili though. You know how Vietnamese have the fresh ones? This one's kind of pickled. Okay, bon appetit guys. Olivia, did you pray? Pray. No. Nope. Like nope. Not today, huh? Mm -hmm. We are done with lunch and now we're going to check out this hotel. Very nice waterfall looking thing. 
Oh wow, you took over Evelyn's spot or what? Yeah. <laughs> Such a princess. She just took over Evelyn's spot. I know. Perfectly good chair right here. Maybe I ought to sit in this chair. No. <laughs> okay. Moving on to this area, Cascades. Oh, yeah. Here's the garden area. Check it out. Look how cute. A big gazebo. I think that's a restaurant too, huh? You think it's a restaurant too? Yeah. Well, it looks like a museum. Has some cute music decorations and ornaments here. Floating ornaments. This is new at the hotel. Basically, it's like a big ass pool. And um, we're gonna go check it out and see what it looks like. And they have rock climbing here. Here is the arcade section for the kids here. The hotel. And the pool table over there. Come on, let's go check out the pool. The sound waves. All right, all right. Where did Lynn go? This way? Hey, where did Lynn go? There's big windows over there. Here it is, sound waves. A big pool for the kids to swim. You gotta pay to get in, but no one's swimming today, so we're just gonna check it out from the sidelines. Hi, how are you? So excited, huh? Huh? <laughs> so sweet, darling. And then over here, more games, arcades. Here's a better view. You can do some uh, surfing right here. There it is. And uh, over there is a water slide. I don't know if you guys can see it, but let me zoom in closer. There it is. I've always wanted to do that. You've always wanted to do that? You can do it now. We can just go in there. I can just do that. Try that, right? Yeah, last time we were in like Singapore, Brian did that and he lost oh, his he? wedding ring. In there? In there. I told him. That was when he was skinny and his hands were small and the ring just fell no right off. Escape now. Yeah, so he bought a different one. This is a replacement. I mean, Phil's mention was, I said, hey, man, hold my waiting room. I think I might get lost. She's, no, 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 I don't want to. I got lost. <laughs> it's still not my responsibility, my friend. Okay. Aw, look at them. They want in. Next time, baby girls. Next time. I just went to the restroom because I felt something funny. And... How are you, honey? How are you, sweetie pie? Aw, you're so adorable. Hey, Brian. Just want to let you know that today is the official day of my period. No. Yes. No. Right now. <laughs> it's, a, it's early then. I guess. It's quite early. Hmm. Well, in that case, let's go cheers to that. Yes, let's go get some drinks. Get some drinks. <laughs> Look at him. Let's go. Champagne. Not celebrating today. <laughs> Evie's happy, huh? Huh, Evie? Yeah, you are. You want auntie? You want auntie? Yeah, you do. <laughs> She's so adorable. Adorable. <laughs> and what do you think you're doing? I gotta update my calendar. Why? I gotta make sure the plowing days are on here. Oh my god. <laughs> you got one more month, my friend. One more month. You can put down any OB days you want. Your opportunity is limitless for the next month. This one right here. Press this one right here to click it, okay? I want to escape. Escape from the babies! Okay. Wait, wait, you're both playing. What? They're both on. There's so all, all three, yeah, yeah. Not. Yeah, it is. Oh, is yours? Yeah. So only only Lynn's not in. Oh. Leave your daughter behind. <laughs> you're Everyone you're left now. for themselves. <laughs> I can't hear anything. Hey, Alright, I am Ava Lang. Are you ready? Are you ready? You should take Olivia to the tubing, you know? Have fun.
Keep shooting. Reload. I got her. I got her. Keep going. Keep shooting. We're shooting. We're shooting. Yeah, yeah. Here, pull your gun back like this. Okay, go ahead. Reload. Shoot him right there. There it is. Look. Get the monster. Get this guy. Good job, baby girl. Yay. Good job. Shoot him. Pull up. You're right there. Look, Reload. Playing too, look at her. Ah! Run! I green one! Oh, good job, Ollie. You're the green one. I did it. You did it, that's right. Mr. Key was already knocked out, and uh, 
I'm going to prepare, maybe curl my hair for the show tonight. We'll see. We have about three hours until I have to head out to the event. So let's get some sleep, some energy in my system so I can just survive for tonight. This whole weekend have has been a like crazy moment. We have been going out, spending lots of time together. And um, it's really, really like cold. So I feel like going out, feeling cold and like shivering all the time. And I don't know, it's just making me really tired somehow. It's either that or being old. <laughs> so um, let's get some rest. My eyes are super heavy. Thank goodness I got my makeup on. So it's a good thing my sister nagged at me all morning to put my face on. Um, we didn't get much photos in, so I was kind of surprised. She wanted me to put my face on for photos, but we didn't get any photos. It was just kind of strange. But um, anyway, I did it, and now I don't have to do it later. So save some time, and I get to rest up some more. The Aang's left, and look what I found. Evie's sock. What am I going to do with this? Should I take it back home? Hmm, maybe I should. Okay, just took a nap. About an hour, and... I'm gonna curl my hair real quick and then head out to the show. <sighs> Super tired, but the show must go on. I get really lazy to curl my hair because I have a lot of hair and um, sometimes my hair doesn't really like stay in the curls. It really depends on the mood and how my hair texture is, but sometimes it's really so smooth that it just doesn't stick together. But hopefully today is going to be a good day. And um, just the extra effort for the little baby today. So today I'm singing for a show. It's more like a private show for somebody's one year old baby. And um, it's surprising that, you know. It's almost like a wedding style. So usually when people have like one year old birthdays, they kind of just have it at their house or they just invite their like close family and friends over for something small and intimate. But this one seems like it's gonna be like a big thing at a restaurant with like a bunch of people and um, almost wedding style. It's at a Chinese restaurant. So I'm gonna assume that they're gonna serve like a bunch of meals. It's just they're probably really, really excited about their baby. So that's a good thing. Um, it's just to share with their family and friends about their happiness. Because I'm pretty sure the baby <laughs> doesn't really know what's going on until they grow up. So... But I guess it's good to just um, record it and show them the efforts that the parents put out for their kids. So yeah, it's going to be a baby girl. Um, and uh, I'm going to sing there. I think there's going to be one more singer. I'm not sure. But it's me and another singer. Um, in Nashville, they seem to start the party early and then end early. Because they told me to be there around 6 to take photos with the audience, their guests, um, from 6 to 6.15 or something like that. But I think, you know, people, Vietnamese people especially, are going to go, they're going to show up late, you know, like 8 o'clock or something. I don't know. But we'll, we will see. My sister says they might show up early because, you know, it's on a Sunday and people have to go to work, kids have to go to school, so... They might show up early and the show is on time, but we will see. I mean, most of the shows that I do on the weekends and um, the Asian concerts, it starts pretty, uh, pretty late, even though they say it's going to start early. I don't mind. I mean, I guess I'm just going to be there whenever they want me to be there so they have some peace of mind. Because sometimes I know, like, when you're planning something in this big and you have so many other responsibilities, they don't want to deal with another thing and um, having things go wrong on the day of. So I just come chill um, whenever they want me to come, you know. 
I don't want to be late and then freak them out because I know how they can freak out. I've seen it before <laughs> with like other events where singers don't show up until like 11 even though the show started around like 8, something like that and the promoter would just like freak out to the fullest. But yeah, um, just one load off their uh, shoulder helps on their big day. Because I know when my sister got married and like people weren't showing up on time, us sisters were like getting drunk, she was like starting to get bridezilla moments and yeah. We were a hot mess at her wedding, but you know, she didn't pay me to be there, so um, <laughs> I'm kidding. It's just I had a lot to do uh, makeup on her wedding, so we were running late on schedule, so my bad, our bad. So I just curled my hair real quick, something uh, simple. I curled the, my, um, the bulk of my hair, and then um, I like to kind of go back and like curl the top, just little pieces on the top, like like for example, like here and there, just to get that extra volume. So I'll do this piece and then I'll grab another one next to it, you know what I mean? And just give it more lift in this area, more heat. So Earlier I was just focusing on the ends and now I'm focusing on the top part, you know? And sometimes I'll just go underneath it, like underneath here, just to get that extra vavoomness, the extra bounce. Yeah. Same thing on the other side. Just the, the lift right here. Yeah. I'm gonna Uber to the event because I don't have a car. My sister already left. Um, usually, uh, they would pick us up or have someone um, Uber us, but you know, lately I've been telling the promoters and the event planner that I'll take care of it because I don't want them to deal with it. Like again, I said earlier, it really depends. Like some people want to come pick me up, and then there's other people who are really, like you know busy, so I don't want to bother them. But just having it as a package where I'll you know I'll take care of myself, and you just do you, and I'll show up there on time whenever you want me to. So makes it that much more easier, you know? Okay, so after I like curled my hair like this, I used the GHD curler, so 1.25 right here. And then now it's time to volume my hair. This product, ugh, it's like tangled. Like, ugh. Sorry, like I love this product so much. A lot of people have been asking me, does it work? Does it ruin your hair? And for me, it's it's been fine. Like I've been using this for a whole year, no problem. Like everyone's asking me, does it burn your hair? Does it stop working? And it was a really good investment. At the time I got it for like 130, but I think right now they have it on sale because of like Black Friday and Christmas coming up. And I bought it on their website, volume.com or something like that. And um, I recently found it on, or right after I, f I bought it on Volume, right after that I recently found it on uh, Amazon. And so I decided to buy it for my sisters and they've been using it too, so they didn't have any problems with it either. So if you have a problem, then you know, I'm pretty sure you could talk to the manufacturer or the company and let them know that you have some issues and maybe they can just, um, return it and honor your um, request for a new one because I know some products can be defected it depending it depends on like the manufacturer and like it could be a dud which is normal for most products you know they just replace it but a lot of you've been asking me and I swear on this volume like it's everything my hair is just such a blob like flat blob it has no life and this basically just brings all that back into my hair you know what I mean look at that it's amazing so if you want more volume you can go back and do more and of course me I'm gonna go back and do more and you know make it extra vavoom I if you see too much like 
curls underneath or like crimp underneath you can always straighten it out so don't freak out if it's not like perfect just go back and swipe it and it'll be just fine this product is a life saver for people who have hair like me who's just really really like hard to get that volume and I think it's better because I don't have to tease it like when I tease it gets so tangled and when it gets tangled I get like hair loss when I have to like um, comb it back out after the show and stuff like that so it really helps I mean some people might have like problems depending on their hair like with breakage and stuff but I don't have any problems so far so it depends on your hair too and how you take care of it like for me my hair it doesn't it doesn't break and I think it's because I probably take good care of it I use um, Olaplex and I use like good conditioner to like make it look good and it really helps so not only that you have to take care of your hair you know there's all sorts of things to keep it from breakage you know so keep that in mind my hair is like dyed all the time so I have to invest in the expensive products to get my hair in check like give it some tender love and care I'll go back sometimes and just like give it some more curls just to make it look extra cute alright so um there's my I guess a mini hair tutorial <laughs> and I'm going to uh, just touch up my makeup real quick because um, I've had this makeup on all day and I had to bake it my sister like She's like, let's put on some makeup, let's put on some makeup. And I was like, oh my god, jeez. All the requestness. But, um, I did it and, uh, good thing I did. Because now, I don't have to focus much on getting, like, my makeup done. Because it's already there. I just have to just touch it real quick. Make sure that it's, like, clean. Because we were in the sun today and it's like really blobby. But I never really have a problem with um, it falling out as much. Because my skin is not as greasy. It's just um, making it more alive. Because I tend to like look dead after a while. And I just have to go back and really clean it up. So not too crazy, not too crazy. Ah. Let's see. Just areas like this, like the T-zones, really help, you know, brighten up my face, clean it up, make it look fresh. But so far, this is why I bake, because when I bake, it just really helps with the lasting of your makeup all day long. Like, this, the baking is life. You, you need to bake if you want to have it last all day long. And I have my makeup on since like 9 a.m. Right now it's about like almost 6 p.m. So yeah. Huh. Gotta snatch my nose because you know, I got my daddy's nose, you know. It's kind of like, <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. You make do. You make do with what you have and be happy. Go back with a little blush right now. And then I'm going to um let's let's do some more highlighters because highlighter brings back everything. This is the Becca highlighter in the style of Champagne Pop. It's very neutral, nothing too crazy. If you guys want something soft, this is your go-to. You know, it helps. Crazy, so oh, hard to do makeup when lighting is like. Ugh. Anyway, um, for lipsticks, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do it there because I feel like it's gonna be a long time, and um, I don't want to mess it up. So there you have it, my um, touch up, touch up tutorial. <laughs> Alright, let's head out to the show. 
I'm just on time. Hair in check, makeup in check, um, hubby in check, hopefully. <laughs> Here's my costume for tonight. It's going to be a, you know, more kid-friendly show, so gotta get my stuff in check, keep it in place, you know. Don't do too much of this, uh, let my girls out, you know what I mean? All right. Rated PG. <laughs> Let's go call an Uber. Outside in the cold, waiting for my Uber. It feels kind of nice out here. It's starting to get hot in the uh, Airbnb. It says Uber should be here in about one minute. Still one minute. Coming close, coming close. Oh, there's one around the corner. Yeah, so it should turn the corner and... Half a block. Yeah. I see his lights. There he is. Yep. Alrighty, alrighty. Okay, we are here at Lucky Bamboo China Bistro, and it looks super early, so I'm on time. I'll carry your stuff, babe. Brian. Brian, I'm Vince. Yeah. Oh. Alright, so... Yes, go into the, okay, uh, hey, how about picture okay. food? Okay, sure. Can I get the bait? I will put my shoes on there. <laughs> <laughs> let, let me put my shoes on now. <laughs> like, where are those shoes at? Nina! <laughs> Why not? Grab me Justin. Grab me Justin. <laughs> Um, I'm just coming out to get take pictures. Yeah. Alright. Request shoes on. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hmm? Okay, photo for you? Alright. Yeah. You guys stand in the middle. Stand on the side. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty. One, two, and three. One more. One, two, and three. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. 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 Here's the back room. Mmm, smells like cake in here. Candles. Happy birthday. No, cupcakes. I know what cake uh, smells like, okay? Alrighty. Candles, it's like vanilla. And we got some goodies in here. This fire is like going kind of crazy, huh? What kind of fire is it? Isn't it kind of going a little like flickery. Oh, they're with crackles. They crackle when they burn up. Okay. And here we have, um, yeah, sure. We have balloons here and our mirror. Yeah. Okay, showtime. Let's do this. Yeah. Me and Justin tonight. What's up? <laughs> oh, happy birthday, then you come and you sing another whole happy birthday slow. I just happy. stand next to you? Just like. Yeah, and then you, you walk up. I'm walking up right now, and then you walk up. And, and then you give birthday. the microphone to me? How no, no, I think he's going to come back and give oh, you the okay. microphone. So you'll have to actually. Okay. So then once you're up there, then the techno will start and then we'll go up to the happy birthday again. Techno. Okay. Yeah. So slow. So then I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go how are you guys doing tonight? Woo! How are you guys doing tonight? Woo! Are you ready for party? Yeah! <laughs>
vân à, trước khi chúng ta bắt đầu vào tiệc thì à, bố mẹ của bé Pearl sẽ có một vài lời à, cảm ơn gửi đến quý vị Good evening. How are you guys doing tonight? Well, thank you for being here. Um, very wonderful to see um, I want to make so many friends and family. I just got here, so I'm okay. just going to pull them in here for a second. Okay. Do you mind? No, no worries. They've been on a trip, so they look like oh, little cousins. Oh, no this is Justin okay. and Minnie. Yeah. Minnie. And this is Antonio Hi. and Ava. Yeah. This show has finally started. It's about like 9.30 and um, Justin is singing right now and he has one more song and I'm up right after him. So yay, finally! We're here in this room and this candle right here is crackling the whole time. It's starting to get a little creepy. I like to have my candles to be a little bit like not noisy because it sounds like bones cracking and like skeleton or something like that. So yeah, <laughs> not that stressless. Let's check out Justin's performance. Okay. 
Wait, wait. Wait, <laughs> wait so what song should we sing then? Um, you can sing us. Yeah, I'll follow you. I'll follow you. Alright. Hello, for those who are not here. <laughs> Cha cha cha, ca khúc từ đây là more than I can say. Mời quý vị lắng nghe. Thank <laughs> you. 
Justin just got off shift, and uh, he's gonna stay here and party some more. I'm going to head back to my place. It's been a long, long, long day. Okay, I am back uh, in my hotel room. Wipe it down. And um, going to uh, finish my ice cream. I've been feeling like really munchy lately. And no, it's not because I'm pregnant, because I'm not. <laughs> Started my um, thing thing today, but I figured I might as well just eat it all because it's, it's going to go to waste. I didn't eat much today at the restaurant because I was kind of like starting to feel kind of stuffy in my costume already. So if I ate more, I can't breathe. So right now, since I'm here and singing is over, then I can indulge. <laughs> anyway, today was a long night, but it was fun. The audience here, they sure know how to party. Like seriously, they were there till the last minute. Everyone wanted to sing, which was great because when you're having a party like that and like your guests want to stay and they're happy and they're satisfied, you know, then you, you threw a good party. And it's not like they sell tickets to get in. This is just a party to, to like celebrate with their friends and say thank you to their friends for coming. I don't know. So for them to just sing along and sing for each other, it's nice to have a group of friends like that. Anyway, um, I'm going to wash off this mask, eat my ice cream, it's so good right now. Ben and Jerry's in the flavor of vanilla. Alright guys, um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, I'll, catch, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. <sighs> Fighting, fighting, stay strong. Good night.